Corporal Russell. Detective Rake, I'm here to help. You don't need no help. Maybe you don't. But your son does. He's scared. I just want to talk. Just me and you. You want to talk? You have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. I did two tours in Iraq myself. I know about the RPGs, the IEDs, the anger, the fear. You're functional. So are you. No, I'm not. My wife. There he is. She's gonna be okay. She's recovering. I don't know who I am no more, though. Everywhere I go, I'm doing threat assessments. As soon as you walk up on this roof, I was figuring out how to kill you. Anywhere I go, every time, every person I meet. A lot of guys come home with these type of issues. I know I did, but they get help. Let me help you. Yo, hey, hey, jo hey John. Yo. John. John. John, I stop, man. Hey, John, I stop. I'm moving it closer. I stop. Come on, John. Go do this. Go do this. You talk this out, man. Things would be much better for me, for my wife, for my son. Jump. No, no, it's not true. A boy needs his father. Not when his father has something wrong inside. Everything you're going through is a result of the combat. It's like the worst, most disgusting hangover you ever have. You can work through this. It's too late. It's not too late. It's not too late. You see this metal I'm wearing? I got this one of those, my father is rich with five AK-47 rounds. I don't know why I survived. Maybe because you're meant to come home to your family. No, it's because I was quick. You know that drill, right? Damn it! Damn it! 